the snows of Ontario where the wind will make you shiver. Twas the month of May up in Georgian Bay near the mouth of the Musquash River. Where the bears prowl and the coyotes howl and you can hear the osprey scream. Back in 99 we were cutting pine and sending it down the stream. Young Sandy Gray came to go all day all the way from PEI Where the weather's rough and it makes you tough, no man's afraid to die Sandy came to smile at 30,000 islands, was the place to claim his glory Now Sandy's gone but his name lives on, this is Sandy's story But Sandy Gray was not afraid and he let out a mighty yell I'll be damned, we'll break this jam or it's breakfast in hell, boys. It's breakfast in hell. Sandy Gray was boss of the men who tossed the trees onto the shore. They'd come and go until they built a flow a hundred thousand logs or more. They'd ride him down towards Severn Sound to cut him up in the mills for timber. And the ships would haul spring, summer, and fall until the ice came in December. One Sabbath day, Big Sandy Gray came into camp with a PD on his shoulder. With a thunder crack, he dropped his axe in the room, got a little bit colder. He said, come on all you, we got work to do. We gotta give her all we can give her. There's a jam of logs at the little jog near the mouth of the Musquash River. No time to pray on the Lord's Day, they were hoping for God's forgiveness. But the jam was high in a troubled sky and they set out about their business. They poked with their poles and ran with their rolls and tried to stay on their feet. Every trick they tried, one man cried, this log jam's gotta speak. But Sandy Gray was not afraid and he let out a mighty yell. I'll be damned, we'll break this jam or it's breakfast in hell, boys. It's breakfast in hell. Now this is your part, my dad's gonna leave. I want you to go, ooh, ha, ooh, ha, ooh, ha, ooh, ha. Now every one of the men did the work at ten, and Sandy scrambled up to the top. He's working like a dog, even 30-foot logs, and it looked like he'd never stop. They struggled on, these men so strong, till the jam began to sway. Then they don't recover to the banks of the river, all except for Sandy Gray. With thoughts of death, they held their breath as they saw their friend go down. They all knew in a second or two he'd be crushed or frozen or drowned. They saw him fall, they heard him call just once, then it was over. And Sandy Gray gave his life that day near the mouth of the Musquash River. But Sandy Gray was not afraid and he let out a mighty yell. I'll be damned, we'll break this jam or it's breakfast in hell, boys. It's breakfast in hell. He's the giant's tomb, there's plenty of room, there's no fences, no walls. If you listen close, you'll hear a ghost down by Sandy Gray Falls. Through the tops of the trees, you'll hear in the breeze the echoes of a mighty yell. I'll be damned, we'll break this jam, or it's breakfast in hell. But Sandy Gray lives on a day in the echoes of a mighty yell. I'll be damned, we'll break this jam, or it's breakfast in hell.